Hello YouTube world. Uh, Rick here with another internet video. Uh, I generally try to do uh, videos that I think are going to help people or that I have had personal experience with and um, this is a bit of both. Um, this video is something that uh, just uh, I guess in the last uh, two months or so we've kind of, uh, my wife and I have kind of struggled with um, and that is when should we tell people uh, that uh, we're going to have a baby. So, this is a tough question. Uh, we had a lot of people tell us that you really should wait, um, wait until you're three months because then you know that everything's going to go well and that, um, you know, you won't feel like you need to explain to people um, what happened if something goes wrong. Um, so that's what a lot of people told us and that's what we did. Uh, we really uh, kept it a secret. Um, and I'm here to tell you that I think there's another way that's maybe a better option um, uh, for for yourself uh, if you're alone or for yourself and your significant other or wife or boyfriend, whatever the case may be. Uh, and that is, I personally believe that you should really tell um, your family and your close friends, um, I don't think there's a need to wait uh, because sometimes... Um, you, you really need support and if um, if something does go wrong you really need that support so you know I, I spoke to my sister I spoke to my wife about this now um, unfortunately just last week um, we had a uh, miss my wife had a miscarriage and um, uh, we were about seven a little over seven weeks uh, pregnant I say we, but you know, you know what I mean. She was, um, and really, I got to be honest with you. The first seven weeks was uh, my first time ever trying to have a baby, which was was planned, and my first time uh, for my wife as well to be pregnant and for us to kind of uh, really be excited and really want this. And we kept it a secret, and we thought, oh, it's going to be so fun to tell everybody, and I can't wait to tell my family and her family uh, and all our friends. Uh, and unfortunately, something went wrong, um, which I'm told happens to an awful lot of people. Um, but you know, if I if we would have told my parents and her parents and some of our close friends, um, uh, we would have one had the support um, that uh, could have been useful in the first seven weeks when I'm just stressed out and don't know um, really what's happening or. Uh, you know what to expect and I'm just nervous and you know it's just very stressful you want everything to go well and you really keep your fingers crossed and hope that it does go well um, and it would have been nice to have some support there you know I have friends that have babies and of course my parents had myself so and my sister uh, and they would have had some useful tips on how to deal with the stress and um, what to expect and you know maybe tell me don't get too excited you know wait um, you know, uh, be be happy, but be cautiously optimistic. Um, and then, of course, when things didn't go uh, the, the way we planned, um, which is really very upsetting uh, to both my wife and myself. Um, but you know, uh, it would have been really nice if people had known, so we could have, we, which you know, it would have been nice if people knew, so we could have went to them and said, hey. You know, we were pregnant. We've, we've had an issue, uh, and uh, things haven't worked out, and we lost the baby. And um, you know, my wife has been in surgery overnight, um, and it would have been really nice um, to not have that extra stress when that happens, uh, or if God forbid that happens to you, uh, it's nice if you don't need to have that stress of you got to face that alone, or you have to have the stress of telling people not only that you were pregnant and didn't tell them, but that something went wrong. Um, so my advice to you is to talk to your partner or talk to whoever you need to talk to um, and agree on a plan. But my suggestion is talk to, uh, talk to your partner. And I would recommend, if I could do it all over again, I would have told my family and a couple of my very close friends. Uh, and I think my wife would agree with me and she would have liked to have told her family uh, and some of her close friends. Uh, because then, you know, for us, when something did go wrong, it would have been nice to just call them and not have to say, hey, we've been keeping the secret and things didn't go right. The ironic thing is is that you don't tell these people because you want to keep it a secret in case something does go wrong. 
But then when something does go wrong, you're going to call them and tell them anyway. So anyway, it's just food for thought. It's one guy's opinion. Um, I just really think, you know, you can use the support of your friends and your family. Uh, I'm not saying go out and tell everybody that you know and work acquaintances and friends of friends and make it your Facebook status or what have you. Um, but, uh, you know, I think it might help you to, to tell your friends and family. You, that way you both, or if there's only one of you, that's fine too. Uh, both or, or you alone get the support that you need from those people that you care about that want to see you healthy and happy and do well. So um, this is something that I learned just in the last little while. Um, um, my wife and I, as an aside, will try again. And um, we really hope that uh, it goes well and it works out and I can be here telling you in uh, in a year how uh, maybe some advice on, on raising kids or how to have a baby. Uh, we'll see what happens. I'll keep my fingers crossed. And uh, best of luck to you uh, if you're watching this video. Odds are you're going to have a baby, and that's great. So congratulations, and I wish you nothing but the best. Um, try to uh, be cool and remember that it's all just, you know, it's all just part of the process. And uh, if it's your first one and you haven't been there before, then you don't know what to expect. So just try to enjoy it all, even the crazy, stressful times, lying in bed, wondering what the hell are we going to do about this. So best of luck, guys. Um, I hope this reaches the people that need it, and I hope it helps you. Peace from Rick.